Well, I dreamt um, to, to skate in the Olympic and then I saw Yvonne van Genep, I saw her win in, in Calgary. And then I saw the, the rings, the Olympic rings, and I saw her and I thought, oh, I really want that too. And then I, I had the chance to go to Nagano. Yeah, and I, of course, everybody's dreaming of a medal on the Olympics. But I came in a flow there and yeah, it took me over the eyes and everything fell together like a puzzle. And then if you stay close with yourself and all the technical parts fell together and I didn't see nobody, didn't hear anything. And then I came over the finish and watched at the screen and then, wow, world record. And that was my first uh, Olympic medal on the 1500. came home, uh, my life totally changed. It was a, such a big uh, event and the whole Holland, it was like everybody was watching the Olympic Games. And yeah, that, that was um, a weird, weird thing to, to, yeah, to feel and to uh, get through. If, if you get well, well known, then if you go to the supermarket, people talk to you. I, I had a lot of friends once on another day, so that's, that's weird. Yeah, well, it just happened, so go with it, go with the flow. And uh, it is, yeah, it's sometimes hard because then you want to do the normal stuff. And I, sometimes I took the dog with me because for the dog, nothing changed. It's still the boss of still his mate and I train with him. But for a lot of people, it's like, yeah, they, 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 they felt and they saw it and they want to touch you and want to cuddle with you and want to talk to you and, yeah, want to say personal things. And sometimes you don't have time for that. And I think you come in a lot of um, house rooms, people watching TV, so it feels comfortable with you. But I don't know a lot of people, so that's sometimes a little difficult to, yeah, how you deal with that. It's, it's try to stay nice, but say, oh, I'm sorry, I've not, not time now, and then move on to the training or something. Mm -hmm.